Hi there, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to do a double unboxing of the iPhone 6 and the iPhone 6 Plus. This is my wife gold iPhone 6 and this is my iPhone 6 Plus Space Gray 64 gig, 16 gig because she doesn't need more than that. She doesn't use a lot of apps. So let's go ahead and do the unboxing. Let's take away the plastic. You know that inside, basically, you find the same stuff. That's why there's no need to do two different videos. Ooh. So that's the gold iPhone 6. And now we go with the iPhone 6 Plus Space Gray. Be careful. Not to drop the phone like some people did. There you go. Let's start with the iPhone 6 Gold. You know the spec. You know everything about it. You know that uh, it's supposed to bend if you put it on your pocket, which I find to be uh, the greatest bullshit I ever heard. <laughs> and now let's go with the iPhone 6 Plus Space Gray. Let's compare the size. This is 4.7 inch and this is 5.5. So there you go. The iPhone 6 Plus is a lot bigger, of course, but coming from the Note 3, I think I will not have any issue with the size of the iPhone 6 Plus. And actually, let, let's compare it to the Note 3. That was my previous phone. You know, I was an Apple addict and uh, last year I moved to Android. I had, um, uh, I had the Sony Xperia Z1, the Xperia Z2, the Galaxy S5 and the Galaxy Note. And I've decided to go back to Apple because this is what I like, this is what I prefer. I like premium look. I don't care if this has less features than this one. At the end, it is what your personal usage of the phone. And, uh, and what happened with the Samsung Galaxy Note is that you have a lot of features. You use them once or twice just to show your friends, to impress them. And at the end, you ended up using the phone just a normal way. So for me, the Apple, the iPhone is more than enough. I don't need to have two screens at the same time. I don't care about the, 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 the fancy stuff because at the end, I'm not using them. So again, you can compare with the Note 3. The iPhone 6 Plus is just a bit taller. But at the end, I mean, you can really feel the premium, the quality metal used in this phone. Don't get me wrong, I like a lot the Note 3, it's a very very good phone, it's one of the best smartphones out there, but I'm definitely sold on this one. And really believe me, I've seen tons of videos, unboxing, reviews, but once you, you get in the hand, it's another story. Um, I did four hours uh, in line this morning at the, the local Apple store from 6.30 in the morning, and uh, once I was into the uh, Apple store and I took it in my hand for the first time, then it's really something's different. Uh, let's take away the plastic. Mm, let's do it slowly because that's the best part of the unboxing. Ooh, very nice. I'm not going to take away the plastic of this one because this is my wife's one. She didn't see it yet, so I will leave that for, for her. What's inside the box? Let's put the iPhone 6 Plus here for one moment. And into the box you find the usual stuff. The little tool to remove the SIM card. The famous Apple sticker. Some books manuals. The earbuds. Same as last year. And power supply and the uh, lighting 
cable. There is nothing else in the box. That's it. And uh, something else I purchased also this morning is the leather case for my iPhone 6 Plus. I didn't buy it for my wife because I didn't know which color and which kind of, of a case she would prefer. So I just bought mine. I will do a separate video about the, uh, the leather case for the iPhone 6 Plus. So there you go. Let's put them again together. iPhone 6 Gold, iPhone 6 Plus Space Gray. Wonderful. And you can see I have average hands and it's, it's really okay. And at the end, I don't put my phone on my pocket. I never ever put any smartphone on my pants pocket. You know, so for me, it's really not an issue, all this band uh, shit about it. Okay, thank you for watching. See you on the next video. Bye.